For the first time, we're getting a look at what's being described by Navy SEALs in Thailand as the operation the world will never forget. This video just released showing the SEALs preparing to begin their diving mission into the cave system to rescue the 12 soccer players and their coach. Water up to their chests as they prepare to scuba into the murky cave waters. You can see the guide wires that have been set up, the divers holding on to them, starting their voyage in the dark. The new video illustrating the excruciatingly narrow tunnels that must be navigated. Tunnels that could become deadly at any time if portions of the waterlogged cave collapse and boulders or rocks fall down. Major Charles Hodges, the mission commander of the U.S. Air Force unit involved in the rescue operation, says nothing like this had ever been done. We understood that there was no other option. Uh, working with the Thai, we realized that they had gone through the decision matrix the right way, and every other option was quickly leading to dead ends. And even though this was extremely risky, with a low probability of success, there were no other options. Especially once we found the kids, we knew that we had to to follow through on this. The new video also gives new appreciation to the near total darkness divers operated in, having to navigate the cave while carrying their bulky oxygen tanks, surrounded by cliffs, and at times having to climb steps. The journey taking hours, but the divers get to where the maroon boys and coach were waiting. Dr. Richard Harris is an Australian diver who was the only doctor involved in the rescue and was the last diver out. The boys, some of whom do not know how to swim, had to use scuba equipment, but each was strapped to two divers. It's grueling work for the divers, securing the boys onto stretchers when they were on dry ground, covering them with silver thermal blankets, and carrying them through that zero visibility, through the cave system, swimming through the water, walking through the water, at all times being careful not to trip on jagged rocks in the cave, which could lead to disaster in the dark waters with a tricky current. But the mission to rescue the boys and their coach is a success. The big heroes in this are these children and the four Thai Navy SEALs who are looking after them. They're the toughest blokes and kids I've ever had the privilege to meet. And now the boys are in a hospital, in face masks, but in good health, giving victory signs for the camera. Their families on the other side of a glass wall for right now, grateful their children are alive, grateful to their rescuers and waiting for when the doctors say it's okay to hug their boys. Gary Tuckman, CNN, Atlanta. Mission accomplished. Began back on June 23rd, the Wild Boar soccer team, 12 boys aged 11 to 16, and their 25-year-old coach, were exploring a cave in northern Thailand when seasonal rains flooded the entrance, forcing them further in. After nine days of searching for the boys, then came the rescue effort. It unfolded in Chiang Rai, Thailand. The group was found two and a half miles from the cave entrance. <laughs>